Richie, thanks for joining us. Another disappointing and frustrating afternoon. Um, maybe a cruel ending for us. I don't think he was much in the game. Second half, they was on top, put a lot of long balls and pressure, and their subs made a, made a difference. But um, we were second half. We weren't good enough. wasn't brave enough to play. First half, we wasn't brave enough to play, but we was okay. Um, and that's the biggest frustration that we come here, and we've got young players that that um, will get better in time. But you've got to be brave enough to play, and we, and we wasn't. And there were injuries as well. What's the update? Is it too early to yeah, say? Yeah, subs didn't help us. We've got, we've got Charlie Kelm, who's got um, a tight quad. Um, TJ, we'll, we'll wait and see. And we had a couple of others that subs that we, we needed to make. Um, you know, and really didn't our subs make a difference? Not really. Their subs, you put, you know, you're going to get load of long balls. Chini, Ch- uh, Chuck Chinik is going to lean in. You're going to get midfield runners, and we were just caught in between. We don't get to the ball. And, and ultimately, um, midfield player runs off one of ours, and it's, it's a good finish. But they always started very brightly. There were a couple of chances. No, and, they, no? they yeah, it was okay, okay. But they give you so much spoon to play that we just wasn't brave enough to play, and that's the biggest disappointment. Um, that we didn't hurt them enough, we didn't get in enough pockets. I thought Donnelly shown signs of quality. Um, our press was good again when we get it right, but when we get the press and they, when we press them, they just play long balls down the channel, and they've got Campbell who's a winning, willing runner and quick. But when we win it and we play back in, we don't recover back into our shape. So there's, there's loads of things that we can get better with and they're just little details. But when you come to a club like this and you've got a load of players with experience, their average age would be a lot a lot higher than ours. And sometimes when you're that age age bracket, you can play average and win. And I think they've done that today. And of course, the debutant today was just 19 years of old, Jamie. As you can see, he carries the ball well. He's got talent. He played um, Ollie O'Neill in... In the first couple of minutes, but we didn't we didn't get him enough of the ball. We we played nowhere near like like I wanted to play today. So um, disappointing. It was a big game for Zach Hemming. He looked confident in the first half. Well, Zach, good character. I thought he played well. Um, he's responded well for a couple of mistakes, but we it's nothing that we we didn't expect. And in terms of the transfer window still open, are you able to bring in those experienced players you say you need? Um, we'll we'll only be after maybe one more. What position would that be? I don't know yet, Dave. I see. And obviously, will that be before Birmingham? Um, we just and see. It's, it's, it's difficult because you know the the lone players from Premier League clubs like Jamie Donnelly have come back now from them being involved in their Premier League teams, and it just it takes a little bit of time for these clubs to make a decision. We're we're looking at a couple, but let's wait and see. Is it too early to say whether or not those players that were injured this afternoon will be available for Birmingham? Oh well, way too early. Yeah. <laughs>